What's up guys? Welcome back to Jeremy Coates Outdoors. Today we're going to be doing a little bit of a tutorial. I'm going to show you guys a few knots and show you how, how to tie them because it's obviously important as a fisherman to know exactly what kind of knots is best in a situation and what knots are the easiest. So I'm going to show you a few knots and hopefully you guys like this tutorial. If you do, smash that thumbs up button, shoot me a subscribe, just click it, it's free, and then you'll be able to enjoy the channel and all of its magical wonderfulness. It'll be wonderful. Join, join the Jayco family. All right. So we're going to show you a few knots. I got the hook and the line. Hopefully you guys will be able to see it. I'll get you zoomed in here real quick. Come on over. All right, guys. So the first knot I'm going to show you is called the Palomar knot. So we got our hook here. The first thing that I do um, for most hooks is what I'll do is I'll double the line over. So that way you have this little loop. Feed this through the eye of the hook. Feed that loop in the round. Then what you do is you tie just a regular overhand knot. Take your loop in around, pull it through your opening, pull it down. Make sure it's kind of loose here. Make sure it goes around the hook. Your little loop in there. And then at this point, I try to make sure this piece is kind of loose. Then you need to pull your, your tag in and your main line in, and then you kind of cinch it down. Once you get to about this point, you'll wet it down. I'm not going to do that for the sake of the video, but you wet it down and then you cinch it up. It's super strong knot. It's my favorite knot. It's the one I use most of the time. Uh, it's doubled up, so it's super strong. Highly recommend this knot. Great knot. All right, let's move on to the next knot. These are not my braid scissors. These are just regular scissors because I was at the boat, but it got a little dark, so it came back inside. So I cut the line. All right, starting again. Here we go. All right, so the next one I'm gonna show you is called the Improved Clinch Knot. Pretty simple, double it over, feed it through the hook, the eye of the hook, whoops. Feed it through the eye of the hook like that, pull the loop end out, do a overhand knot, just like that. Then come down around the hook and then you cinch it up. Bam! Easy. Super strong knot, doubles over at the eye, super straight, super strong. Love this knot. Great knot. All right. Move on to the next one. Braided scissors work way better. <coughs> All right, so the next knot, the Albright knot. This one's really confusing. It's, it, most people don't use this one that much. Basically what you do is you double it over, go through the eye of the hook, make an overhand knot, and take your loop in, and you feed your hook through the loop, and then you cinch it up, just like that. So. You know, a lot of people don't use this knot that much, but you know, it's a, it's good knot. It's good knot. All right, let's get ready for our last knot here. This is the one that most people don't use that often, but you know, just want to give you an idea of what these other knots are are like. So this one is called the surgeon's knot. Uh, it gets its name because the surgeon made it. And that's what they use during surgery. Put your loop in through the eye of the knot. Tie an overhand knot. Feed your hook through. And then cinch it up. So, bam. Just like that. Super, super simple actually. Not bad knot. I'm just kidding guys, hopefully you guys understand, I'm just joking. These are all the Palomar knot because it's my favorite knot. Highly recommend it, it's the one that I recommend everyone throw <laughs> pretty much 100% of the time. Um, it is a super strong knot, but hopefully you guys like this video. It is just to be funny, um, but if you like it, 
give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button i appreciate you guys watching jeremy coats outdoors thanks guys